A random stabbing fueled by hate five months after the murder of a Bowie State University student. Prosecutors say the case will go to court as a hate crime. WJC is live. Kimberly Eaton is live with the evidence pointing to the new charge. Kimberly. And Vic, prosecutors won't go into detail, but do say the suspect's online footprint led to that hate crime charge, something students here at Bowie State University say was a long time coming. A deadly stabbing sparked by hatred. His race uh, was the cause of his death. Five months later, prosecutors say soon to be college graduate and newly confirmed Army 2nd Lieutenant Richard Collins III was targeted because of the color of his skin. Murdered days before he finished classes at Bowie State University. He was going to school, doing what he had to do. And then that happened to him. Now locked up and waiting for trial, his accused killer, Sean Urbanski, at the time a University of Maryland student. Investigators say he chose Collins at random while the victim and his friends waited for an Uber to pick them up on the College Park campus. Urbanski has since been linked to an alt right nation Facebook group. We have enough evidence to file a hate crime charge, uh, which is what the grand jury indicted uh, the defendant in this case for today. Tuesday, state's attorney Angela also Brooks would not confirm if Urbanski. Facebook footprint was the evidence behind the hate crime charge. It was obvious. What other possibly motive can it be? Mm -hmm. I think it's race and it was just uh, the motive. The Anti-Defamation League issued a statement to WJZ reading, while we remain saddened by the loss of one of our community members to this senseless act, we are encouraged that authorities are treating this situation with the gravity it deserves. It is always important to be able to call a hate crime what it is. And Bowie State Administrators also sending us a statement tonight reading, quote, While it is encouraging to see progress being made in the criminal case, we continue to reflect on the precious life lost. Reporting live in Prince George's County tonight, I'm Kimberly Eaton for WJZ. Kimberly, thank you. Prosecutors expect this case to go to trial in January. Urbanski could face life in prison for murder charges and an additional 20 years for the hate crime charge.